Oh, sh**. What time is it? It's time for the Royal Goose. Hello, welcome back. Yeah, 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 yeah. If All you right. got one more. So you wait, wait. Now go. Uh, wait, what's left? Oh, the last yeah, one. Yeah, yeah, you want it slow-ish. All right, do it around three then. I think it's at three. No. Okay. Good job. Yeah, that should be good. Yeah, <laughs> you want it moving, but not like crazy fast. So you can climb easy. Oh, stomp on the thwomp. Yeah. That's the one we have to get. Yes. Oh, right. Okay, that's Which one why. did okay. you think it was? <laughs> For some reason, I thought it was the, the, the cage one that I got in the last episode. Oh, okay. <laughs> Sorry, James. I'm forgetting his short-term memory. You I'm Rick James, bitch. <laughs> what? You said, That's the Dave Chappelle bit. I thought, I thought you said Mick James for oh. some reason. I'm Rick James, bitch. Rick James is crazy. He once had a prostitute come over to his hotel room and locked her up and tied her to a chair for like two days straight and fed her cocaine and water. Yeah. Is that true or are you making yes. that up? I believe that's true. Jesus. So was he arrested? Uh, I'm pretty sure. Get He's good. also super fucking rich, so he probably got out of it. He got just a slap on the hand. <laughs> probably. <laughs> Dude was fucking crazy. Rick James. I, yeah. I don't really know anything about him. Rick James? Yeah, dude, I know nothing. Famous musician? Oh, that's who he is. Okay. Here, let me play you some Rick James, but we'll have to beep it out. <laughs> okay. Because it's copyrighted. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Maybe I can play it so it's really... We'll talk over it. Okay? Even though we can share video game music on our show, and it, that's not copyrighted. But if we share yeah. stuff by musicians... Here. Oh, that's Rick James? Yeah. Can't touch this? No. Oh, it's super free. Yes. This was before... <laughs> no, no, no. You're right. I've had this conversation with a million bajillion people. Can't touch this is literally just the, the same sample uh -huh. from Super Freak. Um, it's not the other way around. Yes, correct. Wow. Super Freak came before. Can't touch this. No way. Yes. Wow, dude. I thought it was the other way around. I'm pretty certain. That's funny. I'll double check for you. Uh, and then we'll we'll put that shit on the screen or something. Or I'll, I'll look up now. Fuck yeah, it. Yeah, dude. <laughs> While you got, you know, while you're not playing. Video when games. did Super Freak come out? I'm pretty sure uh, I can't touch this. Was like early 90s. Hmm. Okay. When did Can't Touch This come out? Bam! So if you didn't hear that, uh, Super Freak was 1981, and Can't Touch This is 1990. Hey, by the way, you know what I... I... Hey, super freak, super freak, super freak, uh... Yeah. By the way... I'm Rick I... You know, there's actually something we need to stop doing every episode. What? We can no longer say, okay, Google. You know why? Why? Because if you watch this episode on YouTube on your oh phone... Oh, my God. It triggers, it triggers Google. That has happened to me so many goddamn times when Holy I rewatch the show. See? Right then All and right. there. All right. Apologies to the audience. <laughs> Holy fuck. I've been meaning to tell you, but I keep forgetting. All right. That's yeah. great. That's really good to know. So it just, it pauses your video and interrupts it. So it's super Damn, freaking annoying. that's awful. Yeah, isn't that stupid? Okay. Sorry, oh. listeners. Yeah. And this is also a good time to, to say, fucking subscribe, you son of a bitch. Mm-hmm. All right, here we go. I don't think your mom is a bitch. Final level. <clears throat> Let's do this. I think she's a kinky. <laughs> Foxy lady who can do whatever the hell she wants. You know, Unless you're not on good terms with your mom. Then fuck your mom. <laughs> fuck her. You're better than her. But if you like your mom, fuck you. Your mom is a great fucking woman. You better treat her better. Um. <laughs> huh. huh. Do I share? Yeah, fuck it. It's on my mind. I'm going to share it. Um. Y you James, know. James, don't talk about how horny you are again. So so the girl that I, I started dating, she's a, she's a hardcore feminist and... One thing that I remembered recently, this opinion that I have, have you noticed that, like, people will say, like, when they talk about guys, when they see guys having a lot of sex, it's like, oh, okay. But then when they see girls have a lot of sex, it's like, oh, what sluts? It's like, what? Yeah, it's, it's a double Fuck standard. You. It's totally uncool. Yeah, well, it's like, the, unless the guys have, they, most guys have sex with women. So, obviously, th those women have to have sex for that to happen. So, why is this? <sighs> it makes no fucking sense. Okay, so... It's so stupid. Yeah, it's it stemmed from... Whatever, I'm gonna get a lot of hate for this. I don't fucking care. Say it. Uh, it's, Say it, It bro. stems from, like, biological uh, roles. Uh -huh. Like, historical biological roles. And I understand that we've evolved past this. I'm not saying that this is okay anymore. 
on any level i am not saying this is okay behavior okay let me just fucking get that out there so you you don't get your tizzies in a fucking tiz nut <laughs> right um get your twinkies in a wrinkle <laughs> historically biologically men like not just in humans in pretty much all species their goal their biological goal is to spread their fucking seed uh -huh. so they go around fucking raping women and female animals and having sex with as many partners as possible or trying to win over as many mates as possible uh, whereas women can only have one child at a time, right? Yeah, uh, yeah. Or at least get pregnant once at a time. Because for other species, you can have, like, a litter. Or, well, humans, too. Yeah, you can have twins and shit. But generally speaking... Octuplets. <laughs> yep, yeah. But, generally speaking... So, that's why it's historically uh, based where, uh, you know, women have been shamed into um, not having sex with multiple partners. And that's yeah. why in, like, you know, the Middle Ages and shit, like, men had, you know the right to do whatever the fuck they want with that kind of shit but i'm not saying it's okay i'm just saying that's where it comes from hey, it's, it's okay uh, you're fine dude no i'm not a fucking apologizing you i know you're fucking but other people are I like know. other <laughs> people are like i'm triggered i'm like well then trigger this bitch fuck you um i don't like you people <laughs> i don't like you people um get off my dick okay you know what the, um before i continue on i just want to say this level is freaking i have a newfound like I do enjoy this level, but I, I dislike how often you have to go up and ride on the magic carpets in this level. It takes such a long time. Yeah, I don't so know. Well, it's kind of, it's kind of nice that it's the last level. You know, like winding down with the shit. I feel like this level they like they planned out all the other levels in there. Like this one, they're just like, how many 3D models can we just fucking like litter the sky with? Yeah, Let's just like put shit every like. It's not an aesthetically pleasing level. Yeah, it's not as aesthetically. It, it, this is like pre. This is like the precursor to Mario Galaxy if you think yeah. about it. Yeah. Um, kind of is. Um, oh yeah, so what I was gonna say was, there's this freaking college humor video that somebody, a friend of mine showed me in college, and okay. it, was it's- Was it funny when you were in college? I, I guess it's, here's what happened, it's about the, um, walk of shame okay. that women go through on college campuses after they have a, a have sex with the guy at right. his dorm room, okay. and they talk, it just showed how like, the- the, everybody's just looking at the women as they walk across campus and how judgmental they are. Meanwhile, like the guys who just got laid are, are like partying together, like, yeah, we got laid! Woo! Okay, so it's Where, like a, um, an over the top portrayal of that. Well, it, it's like a, a, it's like a mockumentary. It's yeah, like yeah, a humorous okay. documentary. And okay. Just the whole time I was watching it, I was like, wait, what? Why, why is it shameful for the women? And I, I just think that's fucking backwards. It's stupid. I think it depends on the person. Like, yeah, shame is internal. So you can't go blaming society for, like, 100% of the shame, right? Like, no. yeah, you, you should know that, like, people are going to unfairly judge you. But that does not mean that you should feel shame. If you feel shame, that is internal and you can internally overcome that shame. Yeah, dude, it's... Right? You can be like, okay, I'm embarrassed by this. Uh, I'm embarrassed because people are unfairly judging me. Okay, well, I need to, like... Over time, it's not like you can just switch it on and off, but you need to like get over it yourself. Be like, okay, Ow. well, I don't agree with these people judging me, so uh, fuck them. Like, just yeah, don't dude. pay attention to these fucks. Yeah, it's just, yeah, dude. I, I, that that's the best way to look at it. I think you know, just hate is gonna hate. Haters gonna hate. Fuck you, bitches. You shouldn't feel fuck shame. Your fuck uh, your fuck your Um, yeah, no, dude. I I just think that's backwards, and that really annoys me that people think like that. It's like fuck you all. It is, but I mean. <laughs> Again, I'll get hate for this. I don't fucking care. We live in a day of, in age. I'll get a shit ton of flack for this, but fuck. <laughs> oh, I wait. Really... No, no. Are you fucking serious? How many times did I jump the gun? Are you How many times did I jump the gun? How many times did I jump the gun? Oh, no. <sighs> yeah, baby. They didn't think. Uh, it's the last level. They probably just. <sighs> they probably didn't have time to. Yeah, baby. God damn it. All right, really? well, just fucking jump off. Redo. Okay. Should we just cut to here? Cause it's no. Let me see if I can. Uh, I can probably just salvage this. I could probably figure this. Okay, out. so you're gonna want to here. Here, I know a good jump angle. No, just tell me where to go. Okay, like 45 degree angle. Well, towards the camera now, basically. Uh, so here, get one. on that bridge. Okay. It's like yeah, yeah. You, okay. Look like straight off that bridge, basically. Straight this maybe way. Maybe you can make that. Maybe not. <laughs> I don't fucking know. Oh, oh maybe that. Maybe. But then again, how, how do I get on that glass case there? I don't fucking know, man. <sighs> I was thinking, yeah, yeah, do that angle. This right, angle? Right, 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 there. No, nope, left. Know. Straight this way? Like the edge of that. You'll go under that lip. 
left there yes okay oh wait no that's bad that that lead oh yeah right there you see that lip that's where you want to go that lip the 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 gray platform yeah we're spending way too much time on this just do it if you die then just fuck it okay you can't salvage this run you have to go for a different star now oh like a boss there you go bam (laughs) ah jesus here we go again all right Okay, if if we fail again, then we'll we'll cut to it. Look how much time you saved by us fucking talking about that and then getting back to the beginning of the level. Hey man, I like to think before I leap. You uh, know, you know me. Ooh. I don't jump the gun ever. How many times I that I don't jump the gun? I thoroughly plan out all my actions and all repercussions. Speaking of repercussions, <laughs> I'm gonna say some shit that'll fucking give me some flack. I don't fucking care. Uh, are we doing this more today? Okay. What? Are we doing this? Oh no, today? I was gonna fucking say this earlier okay. and then we fucking got off topic. Okay, go for it. Because it relates exactly to what we were talking about. Go for it. Um how you like shame and things like that. Mm-hmm. Uh we I feel like right now, just because of like social media and things like that, a lot of people have spotlight where they may not have had spotlight before. Uh-huh. We live in a time where a lot of people uh like to express their hardships almost as like a token of like everyone else owes them something because they're like going through hardships right a lot more bullshit is expressed nowadays a lot more bullshit is heard from like a lot of troubles more troubles are heard exactly too. so people think pe- people basically off take the blame for like anything of self-development right of like i feel shame because of this this is society's fault for judging me for this in mm. part you're correct people shouldn't judge you for that and maybe you should speak out about that but it's 50 50 the other 50% is, is how you interpret ha- it. Yeah, people have to take ownership of their own shit. If they don't like how something is, they should change it themselves internally first, then try and change it externally. Agreed. That's all I'm saying. Because there's only so much like you can do to change yeah. other people. But people are like, oh, you're blaming the victim. I'm like, yeah, sure. I'll give some blame to the victim in some scenarios. Like, Just because shitty things are happening to you does not give you a get out of jail free card. Yeah, it's like... You, you, You've got to deal with it still. You like, guys need to uh, pity me and sympathize like, with me. Change the words you're going to use because you could offend me. Like, sorry. Like, uh, we have the First Amendment right to say what we want if we think it's funny and, like, not, you know, hateful to others. Mm-hmm. Like, shit. <laughs> Just, like, deal with it. Hey, guys. We're the Royal Goobs. We don't like PC culture. What? what? I didn't know that. Yeah, wow. Man. We've never talked about that before. Yeah. <laughs> mm-hmm. <laughs> Okay. Okay. Woo-hoo-hoo. Nice. Oh, done. thank Jesus. Oh, I did it. Okay. Good job. Well, we're 12 minutes in, so next time on Royal Goobs, we're gonna we this go story. on a magic carpet ride, a whole new world. We're going to have to come here again, I think, for the coins, for the 100 coin challenge. A new, fuck me in the ass.